support in your vote 2024. A group wants to shake up next month's gubernatorial primary, encouraging Democrats to vote in next month's Republican primary. They say their goal is to move Indiana politics back to the center. News 8's government reporter Gary Berquist explains who's behind that campaign. The group behind the ads is called Recenter Indiana. The people who run it tell me the only way to bring Indiana politics back to the center is to get more people to vote in the primary. Recenter Indiana has put up billboard ads like this one in Merrillville and Evansville, and they plan to add one on I-465 next week. There's also a social media campaign. In Indiana, recently, whoever wins the Republican primary for governor wins the election in November. And yet only a very small number of Hoosiers actually vote in the primaries. We think that's a mistake. We think more people should vote in the primary, which is where the vote really matters. So we're encouraging people, Democrats, independents, more Republicans, to vote in the primary because that's the vote that's really going to count. Knievel says his group is focusing on the Republican primary for governor because six people are running in it. Jennifer McCormick is unopposed in the Democratic primary. Kniebel says Recenter Indiana wants to remind voters they can ask for a Republican ballot even if they're not registered as Republicans. Is there any candidate in particular you want them to vote for? We hope people will do their own research. They'll figure out which of these candidates represent their values. And we may, in fact, at some point make an endorsement, but that decision has not been made. A Republican Party spokesperson says it is unfortunate that Democrats in Indiana can't win elections on the merit of their own policies, so they have to resort to antics like this. This is a reminder that Republicans should come out to vote in this year's primary to ensure their voices are heard as we elect our party's nominees. This is not any effort to elect anyone in particular, any party in particular. We just want to make sure that the candidates that the parties put forth in the primary, after the primary, are the candidates who reflect the values of 60 percent of Hoosiers. You'll be able to see more of my interview with Kniebel this Sunday on All Indiana Politics. It airs at 9.30 in the morning right here on Wish TV. At the State House, I'm Garrett Bergquist for Wish TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.